Chi. Ray. Furashi. Konnichiwa, Gesuke Karate ka. Uh, basically, I said good hello, uh, Karate Connection students. Important to say hello, very important. Uh, Konnichiwa is one of those words you, it's kind of used hello or good afternoon. Just to let you people know that, very important. Konnichiwa means good afternoon or hello. Important. Uh, usually after 6 o'clock, which it is, it's more considered evening, so then they say konbanwa. So important to remember that. Uh, I want to do a big shout out to two of our winners so far. Our little ninjas was Riley S, our little ninja winner. And our novice peewee, I just did it, was uh, Allie. Congratulations. Uh, not Allie, I'm sorry. Um, Abby, I'm sorry, Abby. Abby was our novice winner. And we also know the drawing coming up for that homework that was sent in was kata. We'll also have another contest we're gonna talk about at the end that you need to submit a video to it to Karate Connection. MMA and Team Highestown, or you can sit it to, submit it to Norm Yockers on Facebook. Really easy to do, parents, if you're out there, if you're listening to this, just take a video of your child on your phone. If it's linked into your phone, Facebook or Messenger, you can send it that way. It's real easy to do. Um, don't get stressed out about it. It's real easy to do. And that's how you get a chance to qualify. Uh, we gave out, uh, we're going to be giving out two goodie bags. The good, goodie bags will be going out Wednesday. And if you win, I'll let you know, and then uh, you send me your address, and I'll make sure you get the goodie bag Wednesday, hopefully. And if it doesn't work out Wednesday, I'll deliver it a different day. But hopefully, we can do it on a Wednesday. All right, so congratulations to the two last winners, one in the novice and one in the um, little ninjas. We'll also have a winner, hopefully, from the advance today. I imagine a bunch of you sent your stuff in, if I remember right. And we'll have another contest every week. So this week, is our focus point is sparring techniques and basics. You're going to hear a lot of basics in combination of what we do. Basics are good because they help your foundation to grow. It's like, how do I do a spinning side kick if I can't do a side kick? Huh. Not going to work so good. So it's important to have a good, strong side kick. Then advanced class, we have a beautiful spinning side kick because we learned how to spin. We already know how to do the side kick. So once we learn how to do the spin, bam -o. Power, beautiful kick. So you always have to have good foundation. So basics are important. We're gonna cover some basic drills, and that could be anything. That could be uh, kicking, punching, blocking, sequences of uh, grappling moves, kata, self-defense, all of this stuff we can do. Uh, breaking's a little hard unless you got a board at home, but uh, so don't think about that. So again, congratulations to our two winners. This week is sparring and basics. Let's get everybody started. Hopefully you got your uniform on, and I hope everybody went out and got some sunshine today. All right, hey, good to see you, Jack. Good to see you, the cooks, uh, Allie and Daniel, uh, Derek, and Lauren, Max, good to see you. I don't know if I got everybody, but I think I just went through as quick as I could on there, some of the people watching. Remember, if you miss this or you're doing this and you don't understand something, go back and watch it again. That's what's really cool about videos. I know it's live right now, but you can always go back and watch it. So if you mix something up in your head, you can always go back and say, oh, wait a minute. That's how you do it. And I'm going to do everything left side and right side. So if you happen to be left-handed, it works. If you're right-handed, great. But I want you to do both sides to keep our body harmonized and equal. And cheat. Let's do 20 jumping jacks. Go. Each. Knee. Sun. Chi. Go. Rope. Sish. Hosh. Ku, chu, chu each, chu ni, sun, sa, go, rope, sish, hash, ku, ni ju, running in place, running in place. Let's throw a jab out like this, little jab. Bounce back and forth, little jab. A little different. And other side, little jab. Remember, if you don't get it, don't worry, go back and watch it again. Fast knees, go, fast knees. And angle other side, fast knees. Jumping jacks, go. Running on plays, run up two steps back. Don't hit the TV. Two steps forward, two steps back. Fast, 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 you got this, come on. Speedball, while you're doing it. Woo, multitasking, come on. Uppercuts, back and forth. Jump side to side, side to side. Faster now. And running again. Jumping jacks, go. All right, have a seat. Two jumped in, boom, boom, boom. 
Thanks for catching everybody. Have a seat. Leg pushes. What are we doing? How many do you think? 30? Okay, let's do 30. Go. Each. Knee. Sun. She. Go. Rope. Seesh. Hotch. Ku. Chu. Chu each. Chu knee. Chu sun. Chu si. Chu go. Chu rope. Seesh. Hotch. Chu ku. Need you. Need you each. Need you knee. Chu sun. Need you see. Chu go. Need you rope. Need you seesh. Need you hotch. Need you ku. Sun chu. All right. Good job. So nice easy warm up. One leg out, one leg in. Touch your toes, not your nose. While we're stretching today, I'm not going to make you count, but I'm going to do some words. Uh, Jodan. Anybody know what Jodan is? Upper level. Good. Switch. Haito Uchi. Haito Uchi. Rich hand strike. Good, good. If you know it, just say it out loud. Awesome. Butterfly. There's a word for butterfly, but don't, I'm not, it's not the word I'm asking. Push them down. Good. S mm -hmm. Almost gave away, sorry. Tashiro Dashi. Good, good. Crane stance. Nice, nice. Legs out straight. Fumakomi Gary Kiyaj. Stomping down heel kick, very good. Shake your legs out. Kagadashi. Cross leg stance, nice, nice. A little hip flexor. Hips forward. Or if you want more of a workout, you can always go back and watch it again. Do the warm up again at the very end. Just go back and rewatch it. Hips forward, good. Other side. Push it forward. Ray. Bow. Good, 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 good. All right, come on up. Roll out your neck. All the way. Slap your back. Our warm ups aren't real long on this, just enough to get you warmed up so you can stretch and stuff. So we're working what? Sparring and basics. Basics could be basically anything. Let's start out with some basics. Positions of discipline. Ooh. We're gonna do the high numbers, 10 to 14. Everybody should know one through nine, should. If you don't, go back and watch uh, the Little Ninjas video today. They did one through 10. And also, um, yeah, watch that video. You'll remember all the one through 10. So make sure you know this, okay? So number 10 is what? Ready stance. Anybody know the name of it? Furudashi, good job, good job, good job. 11, front stance or forward stance. Anybody know the name? Good, good, Zenkatsudashi, very good, very good. 12, back stance, what's the name of that one? Good, Kakutsudashi. 13, cat stance. Niko Ashidashi. Technically, it's cat leg stance, but we just say cat stance. Niko Ashidashi. 14, what's 14? Cross leg, and I'm gonna give you a side angle to see it. Cross leg it is Kagadashi, right? Remember, you're gonna say, when do I do it? You do it in kata, you do it in throws. So important to remember that stance. A lot of people think, oh, it's a useless stance, but remember, it's important because you wanna do a good throw. It happens for a lot of setups and stances. That's the first part of basics. So now we're gonna go into some sparring drills. We're gonna start out with back fist, reverse punch, rich hand. Rich hand, make sure your thumb is tucked down and under. Not out here, you'll break your thumb. Tuck that in. Where do you hit with this? Nose, temple, all that cool stuff. Hey, great to see you, Dean. Great to see you, Dean. One of our higher stand team members from uh, the Bronx. So, I'm gonna do it both sides, ready? Back fist, punch, step forward, ridge hand. So let's think about the dynamics of it. I'm going slow. Face, stomach, head again. So we're working the body up and down. So again, one, two, three. I'm gonna back up a little bit more so you can see me a little better shot from a different range. One, 
two, three. Okay. Again, does my front leg move? No. Very good. Front leg stays until the third technique. One, two, step again, ridge hand, three. Okay, let's go on your own. Do it like five times on your own. I'll do it a couple times faster. Okay, go, start on your own. Back fist, ridge hand, back fist, ridge hand. Okay, now obviously, make sure you're not gonna hit anything when you do this. Okay, especially the TV or brother or sisters, lamps, all that fun stuff. Okay, two more times, two more times. Go, go, go. Nice, nice. Okay, let's switch and try the other side. This is the hard part, the other side. I get a little closer, so you can see me better. Back fist, punch, same hand. Come back, ridge hand. See the thumb? In, you're hitting with this part right here, a ridge hand, haito uchi. Back fist is what? Riken. Reverse punches, Sikin Chakumsuki. Very good. Back fist, punch, step again, ridge hand. So one hand's doing double work. It's punching and ridge handing. Ready? Back fist, punch, ridge hand. Good. Back fist, punch, ridge hand. Good. Back fist, punch, Ridge hand, you got it. Back fist, punch, ridge hand. Okay, five times as fast as you can go. Don't hit anything, I'm just gonna do it a couple times. Go ahead, keep going. Back fist. Okay, sorry, I get going a little faster. Okay, do as fast as you can, but with control, not to hit anybody or anything. Okay, all right, it's fast techniques, so it makes it effective. Very good, good job, good job. Give it another second or two. Back fist, reverse punch, ridge hand. Very, very good. Next technique. Defensive side kick, back fist, reverse punch, axe kick. Axe kick, anybody? Nice. I heard that from Lauren. <laughs> Futakoshi Gary Kiyaj, okay? Futakoshi Gary Kiyaj. Good, good, good. Maybe somebody else said it too. Did I hear somebody else? All right, I did. Give me a thumbs up if you said it. If you said the answer to that question, throw it out there. You might have. Okay. Yep, I saw a thumbs up. There you go. Good, good, good. So, defensive side kick. We're going to do it both sides, slow first. I'm going to go to this side of the screen so you see I'm jumping at a 45 degree angle or stepping. Chamber, side kick, back fist, reverse punch, inside axe kick. Okay? Different than a crescent, okay? You can also go outside axe kick. They're, they're your choice. You go inside axe Hey, Jake, good to see you. Um, I think Jack was in there too. So again, step, side kick, back fist, reverse punch, inside axe kick, or you can do outside axe kick. Your choice. It doesn't really matter to me. What feels better to you? But it's a neat combo. You're being defensive. You kick the person low, stomach, head, body, back to the head or clavicle on the shoulder. In that area. All right, so let's do it again. Step, side kick, back fist, reverse punch, X. Right. Okay, a little faster. Do it five times on your own. I'm just going to do it twice. You do it five times. Go ahead. Do it five times. I'm going to go nice and not too fast, just so you can see it. Okay, I'm not going to go super fast so you can still see it. I'll go a little bit slower. Nice. Five times. Go ahead. You got this. Okay, I think everybody's got five. Looking good. Other side. We gotta do everything both sides. Step. Going on this side of the screen on purpose. So you see that I'm stepping at a 45. Side kick, back fist, reverse punch, inside axe kick. Right, so again, I'm over here. Step. So I'm pulling at a 45 degree angle. Side kick, back fist, punch, inside crescent. Okay, ready? And go. Boom, 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 boom. I'm going just a little faster on this side. Not real fast, just a little. Okay, let's just work it a few more times. I want you to be able to see it. In case you get stuck, you can always go back and watch it later. Okay, 
Now I want you to do it five times fast on your own. Five times fast. Go ahead, five times fast. I'll do it a couple times. You guys do it five times fast on your own. I'll give you a little time to do this. So I... Okay. All right. Make sure you get your five in. Get your five in. Nice. Good. Good, 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 good. Excellent. So those are some good sparring techniques. Now, when you spar, it's important when you're sparring on karate, have one hand down, one hand up. The reason we do this, defense kicks and lower level techniques. All upper body, all mid body. If you're throwing two blasts at the head, both hands come up and you do five and six from the first kata. Well, right now we're dealing with people that kick and punch. If you're on the street and you don't know the person, both hands come up in self-defense stance. And then, because most people aren't gonna start with kicks. They're gonna go right for your face. So self-defense stance and street stance is totally different than sparring stance. Sparring stance, we're in here and we know people can do what? Kick and punch. So it's important because you know they're going to come at different levels. So that's why we have our hands like this, position. Okay, in front of our face. Is it good down here? No, it takes too long to bring your hand up, so have that hand there. Right in front of your face. Down here, you get hit in the face, so make sure it's up here. This hand right here, body, not full. Body angle. Body full gives a whole hundred percent of you for the target. You're asking to be hit. Turn sideways or a 45 degree angle, okay? Or three quarters, they call it. Never go full, full, asking for this. Now on a street stance, it's different, okay? But again, sparring stance, you got all these wild kicks people know how to do, all these unusual strikes that people don't normally do. Most people on the street are straight, jabs and cross, hook punches, tight hooks, uppercuts, that's about what they're gonna do couple loopers like this, they're not gonna come at you with some weird, cool, crazy techniques. Why? Because they don't know it. They're not gonna do that stuff. They're gonna come at with these crazy hooks, maybe a nice jab, cross, maybe an inside hook, uppercut. They're not gonna come at you with anything more high tech than that. So that's why those hands are up in those positions. Okay, in those positions. It goes right back to the first kata. That first kata is so important because it works so much to help us in basics for self-defense. Since I've been stressing that, guess what one of our homework assignments are? You have to do the two sparring techniques I'm gonna show you for your homework assignment, do on Sunday to get possibly a chance to win something. And you're gonna practice one through eight. It's so important to help us for streetwise. So I'm gonna stick my leg back. You put your right leg back, hands are here. Start out with your left hand, ready? One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's the number one homework thing. You're gonna do more than that. That's just the first basic thing. That's the basics part of the homework. One through eight. Why? It's great review for advance. We get lazy and don't do this. So important. Look where my hands are. There's always one up by my face. Always. Always one up near my face. See that? Always. Why? That way my head is protected on the street. That's the homework number one. That's called the basics one through eight. Next part you have to demonstrate is back fist, reverse punch, ridge hand. Here we go again. Back fist, reverse punch, ridge hand. That's what I want to see you do. And then the third part, that's not much, okay? Third part is the last combo we did. Defensive side kick, back fist, reverse punch, inside axe kick, okay? Easy stuff. So that's your homework assignment for next Sunday. You can send it anytime you want, but make sure you have it down clean. That shouldn't take you more than 30 to 50 seconds to videotape it. Parents, if you need help, it's easy. Go on your phone if you have Facebook or Messenger on there. It's easy to do. Videotape it on your phone, go to Facebook, add video to the inbox, 
send it to Karate Connection MMA and Team Hyastat, or send it to Norm Yonkers, I check both of them. Easiest way to get your video to me, takes you more, not more than like 30 seconds to a minute, just make sure it downloads or uploads, technically upload, <laughs> download to upload, okay? Make sure it sends because a lot of times if you stop too soon and walk away, it might just erase it or not get it completely sent. So important, homework one through eight, one through eight, right leg is back, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay? Uh, doesn't matter what side, it's okay with me. Back fist, reverse punch, rich hand, defensive side kick, back fist punch, inside axe kick, okay? The difference between a crescent kick, crescent kick does this. Axe kick goes up, straight down, okay? The axe kick goes up, straight down. Crescent kick continues through. That's our homework, advance. All right, let's dig out our, well, our last winners, last class, uh, novice peewee was Abby. I'm looking, sorry, to make sure I don't say the wrong name, Abby. And our little ninja was Riley S. Today's winner from advanced class. I like this pumpkin. Uh, I can have fun with it. <laughs> Plus, it's like gifts, you know, you know, when you go trick-or-treating, you never know what you get. I don't know if you go trick-or-treating or not, but I bet most of you do, all right? And you never know what you're gonna dig out of here. We had some good submissions like the work it. Now, if you win once, can you win again? Not in the same night, but yeah, you could win again the following week. You gotta have to submit your homework. Submit that homework, okay. Who's the magic winner? This is gonna be backwards when I show it to you on camera because I'm doing it reverse so I can see what I'm doing. Derek Jagoda. Send me your address. I'm gonna try to make a deliveries with a goodie bag for you on Wednesday. Derek Jagoda, congratulations. Everybody else, thank you for submissions. Get those things in by Sunday, people. If you don't submit it, you don't get a chance to win. You have to get those, um, the basic aid in, your back fist reverse punch, ridge hand, and then you also have to do your offensive side kick, back fist reverse punch, axe kick, inside axe kick. Congratulations, Derek. You'll get a goodie bag, hopefully on Wednesday from me. A Karate Connection goodie bag, yes. Congratulations. And like I said, it's backwards, because I know when you look at it on TV, it's backwards. <laughs> All right, everybody, thank you very much. I will see you Wednesday. Hopefully you enjoy this beautiful, beautiful weather. Cheat. Right. Ciao, Mata.